Hey everyone, welcome back to Crown Geek. In this video, I will be explaining that how you can get Windows 10 operating system on your Android mobile. And right now you can see I'm on my screen and I have this kind of a screen where I can quickly log into my account. So what you have to do, you just need to take to the cursor uh, to the password section. Then you need to type the password. And then you have to take the cursor to the next option. And you can see that the Windows 10 screen is now up. The look and feel and the feature, everything will be remaining the same. So if I go and click on the start icon, so you can see there are the options. I can use Microsoft Edge. I can use Groove Music File Explorer. If I click on it, so you can see the File Explorer is coming up. Similarly, you can use all other features of it. You can minimize it, you can maximize it, you can close it. So let me quickly open Microsoft Edge and see that how it works. So you can see the YouTube is coming up. So now you can access any kind of work of your computer on your Android mobile. All right, so now let's see that how you have to do this. All right, so just have patience, watch the video till the end. And if you find this helpful, you can consider subscribing to the channel. So let's see that how you need to install this on your Android mobile. So here we need two different applications that you need to download from Play Store. So on your Android phone, just look for Play Store. In the search box, you have to type Octopus. Then hit enter. And this is the link that you have to look for. You can see that uh, around 4.1 star rating has been given to this application and more than 10 million people are using this application. So you need to tap on install and this will be now installing on your phone. So you just have to wait. Once done, you can minimize it or you can go back and then you have to download the second application that is Win 10 Simulator. This the top one is the link that you have to look for. Even I will leave the link in the description. You can directly uh, go to this application. Tap on it, then tap on install. So this is now installing. All right, once done, again, minimize it. Now you need to open the Octopus, the first application that you downloaded. Tap and open it, then tap on allow. Now it says my games. Okay, so what you need to do, you just need to tap on the plus icon. And then from here, the list, you have to choose wins 10 simulator that you just installed. So tap on add. So now tap on this win 10 again. Then tap on allow. Now it will ask you the permission. So you have to tap on it and just allow, always allow. Give the permission so that you can all uh, use all these kind of features. Once done, go back. Again, tap on the Win 10 icon. Then tap on Skip. Now tap on Skip again. And now it will be coming up the Windows 10 installation screen. So you just have to follow a few simple steps. And you can see the Windows uh, setup file setup screen is up now. So it asks you the language to install. So you just need to tap on Next. You can change the language if you want some different language. Tap next, then tap on install now. Some kind of ad will be coming up. You can tap on close. And you can now see the installation has been started and it looks very realistic, very similar to like what we install on our, our laptop and PC. Once done, it will ask you who will use this computer. So you just need to give any name here and then tap on next. Now it will ask you to enter the password. So you just enter any password. I just take a common random password. Tap next. Then again, you have to type the same password. Then tap on next. Now here again, tap on accept. Now another screen will be coming up. Now here. You have to make sure that Octopus and the Win 10 simulator 
permission has been allowed so keep scrolling down until you find a win 10 simulator tap on it and just enable the permission go back and then tap while using the app so you can see it's now loading up preparing the screen for you so now it asks you to log in so let me quickly log in with the same uh, password Once logged in, you can see that your Windows 10 login screen is now up and now you can access Windows 10 on your Android mobile. So that's all guys for today. Hopefully this video will help you to quickly get this Windows 10 machine on your Android phone. And do not forget to like and subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.